Uh, this day uh, that we commemorate and celebrate the 1954 Supreme Court decision, Brown uh, versus the Board of Education, in this case in Clarendon County, South Carolina, is Briggs versus Elliott. And we commemorate uh, for the last almost 50 years, they make sure that this, this town and this community uh, remember the struggle of people of courage uh, to make a change here. Uh, a thing went throughout the South called the Southern Manifesto to make sure that they could band together to deny uh, children that look like me equal access to education. It was shameful. Shameful didn't work. So you can see how important this case is from the Deep South. And I always had thought, why did the case since South Carolina, the first case on the docket, who changed the docket, what the system to, to have this case come after Brown, uh, 2,000 miles away to the Midwest. Uh, Midwest had a different challenge than what we had here in South Carolina. Uh, Kansas school, high school was already integrated. The elementary school was not. Here, nothing was integrated. So somebody made a decision that you, you all can have this case, Supreme Court, but it cannot and it will not come out of South Carolina. So that's my quest is why the South Carolina do not have the, 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 the clock, the name as Brown v. Board. This was the first case that came to court.